Hey guys, Google has released Gemini 1.5, the new version of the artificial intelligence system that powers their chatbot. This new version promises to be better at processing things, responding more quickly and providing more accurate answers. This update was made using a technique called Mixture of Experts or MOE. This means that instead of using the entire network at once for each search, it only uses a part of it. Google says this makes the system faster and more efficient, allowing it to handle a lot of information at once. The 1.5 model which came after Gemini can work with up to 1 million tokens at the same time, which is far more than the 32,000 tokens of Gemini 1.0 Pro and the 132,000 tokens of OpenAI's GPT. The company that did this wants to increase this to 10 million tokens in the future and they've already achieved this in testing. Now, with this new capability, Gemini 1.5 1.5 can handle a great amount of information that's roughly what you'd get in one hour of video, 11 hours of audio, and 30,000 lines of code or more than 700,000 words all at once. There was a time when Google demonstrated how this works and asked the AI to analyze a PDF that contained everything that was said during the Apollo 11 mission and it read the 402 pages in just seconds. Before I delve in further, a quick note, subscribe to the channel and like the video. This helps a lot and keeps you in the loop. I'm here every day discussing these topics and keeping you informed. Your likes and subscriptions contribute to this project's growth and the bigger it gets, the more awesome videos I can create for you. Thank you so much for subscribing and for your like. Moving on. Enhanced Performance and Safety Tests In the race to create the best generative artificial intelligence, Google said the new version of Gemini outperformed the previous one by 87% in comparison tests that looked at text, code, photo, audio, and video. Even the Gemini Ultra, which had just been launched, lag behind with the new model being 55% faster. The tech company also commented that this new version went through a lot of ethics and security testing to see how it would react to different types of problems. They want to make sure everything is safe before they release it to more people. For now, Gemini 1.5 will only be available to developers and enterprises before being released to everyone in the chatbot that has the same name. There's no word yet on when that will happen, so stay tuned here on the channel. Samsung, for example, is already using this new feature in its tests, working on an AI function for the next Galaxy S line. Got any ideas, have questions or thoughts, leave it in the comments. I'd love to chat about what the video is about. If you like the video, give it a like, share it, and subscribe to stay on top of the news. It's popping up here now, indications of upcoming videos that make perfect sense for you to watch. I'll see you in the next video. See you later.